Now this is a journal, it's kind of like a photo album of the life of a girl named Jennifer who participated in a Tagli Birds Radio Zill trip. And this is basically just a photo album that shows how Tagli, um, how her trip really had a lasting impact on her life in more ways than one and lasted way more than the 10 days, of the short 10 days. This is her with her mascot and this is her with her new mascot which is an Israeli soldier. <laughs> And so this is an example of um, how she brought her awareness home. Whereas before she was protesting uh, animal rights, now she protests and rallies for Israel as well. Putting Israel on the map and recognizing Israel's right to exist. And here we have my favorite one. This is, um, this is Jennifer eating hummus with a fork, um, like a civilized American. And then she learns that Israelis don't eat with forks. <laughs> and Israelis eat hummus with pita. <laughs> So, um, and then you can see also as soon as she, she returned home and on a normal Sunday morning, a normal American would be sleeping in, but instead Jennifer chose to go and volunteer at a Hebrew day school. So this would be her having a secular wedding and then this is Jennifer having a more traditionally Jewish wedding with the breaking of the glass. And then here we have, for example, Jennifer got married. Now she has kids and Jennifer's son, instead of having a regular birthday party for his 13th birthday, he has a bar mitzvah which you'll see in a minute, him putting on tefillin. Very happy. <laughs> Happily putting on tefillin. And this is, the, this is the very, very Jewish, you'll see the very Jewish traditional lifting him up on a chair for his birthday with the party. You can tell it's a bar mitzvah. <laughs> okay. Um, and then we have, um, this is another important part, um, where even though they're not religious, sorry, even though Jennifer's not religious, um, instead of a regular, you know, treating Friday like any other night, they have like a traditionally Jewish Shabbat meal and, you know, they still incorporate that into their lives. And then Jennifer um, brings her family to Israel instead of a, normally, a normal American trip to Disney. They also incorporate Israel and bring her kids to the hotel to see, you know, the roots. 